If you're asked to find equivalent fractions for 5 eighths, here's how you do it. First off, what we're trying to do is find another fraction that's equal to 5 eighths, but has a different numerator and different denominator. So we could multiply 5 over 8 by 1. That would give us the same value. But instead of 1, let's multiply it by 2 over 2. 2 divided by 2, it's still 1. We'll get the same value, but we'll get a different numerator and denominator. 2 times 5 is 10. 2 times 8 is 16. And 5 eighths and 10 sixteenths, those are equivalent fractions. If you divide 5 by 8 or 10 by 16, you get the same number here. Let's try another one. How about 3 over 3? So again, 3 divided by 3 is 1. We're not changing the value. 3 times 5, that's 15. 3 times 8 is 24. If you divide 5 eighths or 15 24 you get, again, the same number, 0 0.625. One more, 7 over 7. So this gives us another equivalent fraction to 5 eighths, or 10 sixteenths, or 15 twenty-fourths. This is Dr. B with several equivalent fractions for 5 over 8. Thanks for watching.